Hi, this is Julia Loves Beginning with a message called Real and Equal Beings. Judgments always put one segment of persons in the garbage. When you judge, you see unequal persons instead of real and equal beings. Your judgment is your belief in the unreal, and it always brings the experience of pain. Take a moment, whenever you can, to remember the real and equal nature of all beings. Find your willingness to see this real and equal nature shine forth. Remember that your power to allow the real and equal nature of all beings to shine forth also belongs to all equally. As this power is remembered and activated in you, it is activated in all. Give yourself the gift of this power by seeing its presence in all you call other. Whatever you're judging isn't the most real thing about that one. What is equal truth beyond every body? You have the power to allow it to shine. Whenever you feel disquiet, you're getting an indicator that you have believed a thought from ego. This is not your real thought. You have had ego sending you thoughts to consistently cover up the equal nature of all beings. Remember this when you feel that twinge or cringe from a belief in egoic thought. I am trying to cover up the equal nature of all beings. I can relax out of this. I can allow the equal nature of all beings to shine forth now. As I can allow it, so can everyone else. It hurts to attempt to rest in what has no stability or reality. Actual stability is here for you to rest in right now. Find your willingness to let resistance go and to fall into what is real. It is truly restful to rest in what is real. You know by how you feel. Pay attention to how you feel, and you always know when it's time to rest in a moment of willingness. Your willingness activates willingness in all beings across time and space. It is no small thing. You get tired, not because of actualities, but because of thinking. You don't have to try not to get tired or to blame yourself for an experience of fatigue. Just go in gently, see what you are believing about cause and effect, and see what there is to release. With any lack of well-being, with any sense of a burden, there is something here to release. Make this work of release primary. And more and more you begin to realize that to look upon another is to look upon joy itself. All you perceive as other are joy itself. And as you let blocks to joy dissolve, you begin to see the truth that has always been here. You are seeing that this release work offers a restoration perceived as earthly solutions cannot. And so you will come to rely upon this work of release, restoration, and remembrance more and more. Resting here, all seen as earthly solutions can be used on your behalf and the behalf of all others. Whatever seems to show up in the world, allow it to be used by spirit for the benefit of all. No matter what it is, seemingly good or bad, put spirit in charge of your perception of it and you are held and carried in peace always. As you allow yourself to be held and carried in peace, you can see the peace at the heart of every being. You can see the peace at the heart of everything you look upon. We thank you for inviting us to look upon your world with you, to show you what is truly here for all. The only thing that is truly here is blessing, and we are always here to help you see. Thanks for listening.